we are going to paint up the X-Max body. And I've got to get the window decals on. Um, but as you see, they creased it. So I don't know how well that's going to work because one of them is through the windshield. And the other one is the sunroof, which really doesn't matter. But the windshield one. Don't know how well that's going to go on without paint leaking into it. I'm not putting a whole lot of time into this because it's an X-Max. It's going to break. stickers are on and it looks like I'm gonna have to drill out the roof for the roof slider on this thing so we're gonna get it painted up and uh, get a new body for the orange X max we'll be right back I'm gonna lay down uh, the first coat so we'll be right back all right so we went ahead and got the body painted up and we got a white backer. So now we're gonna peel up, or peel off these stickers that are covering the areas we didn't want painted. And see how this turned out. What I don't like about these stickers is that they tend to fold on the edges so it's something you have to be mindful when you're painting several coats x max body uh, takes about four cans you can do it in three cans basically two of your main color and one backer one can for backer if you're using a solid color but when you use a translucent paint uh, you probably have to use uh, four cans painted it orange because the RC is orange this will be the second body in a couple of months we did try flex seal on the last body and well the last two bodies and uh, the paste definitely didn't work the flex seal took some pretty hard hits and impacts and did okay but when you have bodies like this that aren't very strong, definitely, uh, definitely going to go through bodies. And that's where the indestructible body that I have on the blue one really uh, stands out and saves money long term. Because this is $40 in paint. I think it was $36 and I used Tamiya paint, small cans.
people have pointed out that you can buy Traxxas paint. Nobody seems to sell it anywhere near me. But you can order it online. So there we go. I did opt for the sunroof to be clear so that I can see if the batteries are coming loose. And I'm hoping that'll help. So we are going to get the sticker pack for the Dodge Ram Hemi put on this body as well. So let's uh, unveil this thing and uh, see what this color really looks like. Nice, shiny, clean new body that definitely isn't going to last long. I'm sure of it. So we're going to get some decals put on this and we'll be right back. All right, welcome back. We are back at the BMX park and we are going to run the orange one with the new body and I did bring out the blue one. I did fix the bumper on the wide X Max. So I just want to do some bashing today. And what better way to do it than with an X Max? So we're going to see how long it's going to take. For me to destroy a brand new body. The other one took a month, but I did uh, line that in Flex Seal. The other one had a steering issue. I think it was the blue one. Um, it could have been this one. I think it was the blue one. The blue one was constantly drifting. So I got that fixed as well. The Dodge body is growing on me. I did leave the sunroof clear and all the windows clear so that I can look inside and see if a battery's coming loose. So I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. It's the first Proline body I've run on an X-Max. Trying to get a handle on it. I like to hit this jump. right on the body already that was a hard hard landing it's got this hop after it lands I think it has something to do with the wheelie bar. So I didn't put the piece on the back, on the far edge. I wonder if I should have uh, done drilled that out and put something back there. Uh, it wasn't drilled out for the roof slider either. And I did uh, use the body post reamer to put that on. The other holes were all there. gets a lot of wind going out here which I'm not hating because it is like I said it is hot today we're up here running because no bikers gonna be out here right now it's just too darn hot they're all gonna start showing up in about probably about an hour
You guys out bashing? <laughs> yeah, it's having some problems. I'm Earl. I definitely like the standard with X Max. A lot more. Just like the way it handles, I guess. Better than the wide one. The wide one seems to grab every little corner. This body has a pretty loud slap to it because I haven't flex sealed it. Somebody left their plastic water bottle in there. You can hear how hard that is with this plastic uh, teeny sound body. shooting right for me. You don't always have to come out here and just send it. The other wheels are starting to come unglued. Wonder if I should crank up the rear on this. A lot of brake. I forgot I turned up the brake on these things to do some front flips. And we did fix the fans on these things. So that's another thing that I want to make sure it doesn't cut off. My daughter disappeared. she went oh, sounds like the body's breaking yeah 
these landings sound like uh, RC's just falling apart. So now with the clear top, I could look in, make sure the fan's still spinning, make sure both batteries that are wrapped in beanies and uh, microfiber are still locked in. Fan seems to be working pretty good. Oh, shut down. I have steering. So that's going to be heat cut. 
even with the fan going that's why this one's so much faster i guess it's geared up just too much Let's see what it uh i know it's not low voltage and it doesn't help that uh Yeah, that motor's burning up. Doesn't help that I have all this uh, microfiber and stuff in here. So I'm gonna do some cool down. because it's a little hot right now. So I guess we'll go back and grab the blue one and rip that. I just wanted to do some ripping today. Don't necessarily wanna do a lot of filming with it. I know everybody's gonna be out there running and watching the ProMoto MX videos, but I'm still gonna post this video. For those that uh, want something different, I'm still waiting for my ProMoto MX. My personal one that I ordered. Um, like I said, I normally buy the the shop's demo model because they always usually sell it. But I think that this drop, as everybody's finding out, is uh, super popular and for good reason. I mean, it's a cool motorbike. But I do see myself still running the X Maxes a lot more than I probably would be running that bike anyway. Just because I'm a basher at art. And I think that Pro Moto MX will do good up here at the track. So I'd rather beat up on mine than somebody else's. And I don't think that this dirt's loose enough. I mean, there's a lot of rocks here. And I'm kind of curious to see how it's gonna handle with all the rocks. But that's just something hopefully we'll uh, see next week. I think it's supposed to be in next week. Chloe, you ready? What you doing? Where were you? Uh-huh. Who's that? Yep, he's sitting there trying to riz on you, huh? Did he talk to you? Why not? Ah. Because he came over and ran where I was for a minute and then went and sat with you. He did not sit with me. No? Who'd he sit with? He was taking TikToks of you. Boy. <laughs> He probably is. Oh, there's an airplane. This thing. I did crush the back of the ram, though. You see it? It's all crooked. Yeah, because you know how to keep a body like decent. Really? Yes, really. Well, how am I supposed to keep it decent when it flips over? At least I can. Oh, you can. Yes. Last time you ran an X Max, you broke a front wheel. Yeah, you did. You nosedive and rip the wheel off. That was not you. That wasn't me. And I don't remember. Yep, yeah, that was over at Central Park. Yeah, I don't remember. Before they started all that construction, we were jumping the rocks in the back. Yeah, I still don't remember. Yeah, you never remember when you break something. Neither do you. I do. No. I remember all my breakages. Uh, uh -uh. All right, guys. So there you go, little video for today. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think of the, the Dodge body on the X-Max. Is it better than the X-Max body? I don't know. But there you go, like, comment, subscribe. Catch you on the next one. Get out there, rip some more RC cars. Fan's still working too. And the motor fans are working. But there's a lot of heat in there.